Hey, what's up, guys? John to get into this video. I want to talk to you guys about, you know, the next version of Grand Theft Auto and what I would love to see in the game. Like, a few, it's not like big changes or anything, it's simply things that Rockstar can add if they're not, you know, smoking that freaking, you know, gold, white gold, or freaking, you know, cracking that, you know. And, you know, they done this in the past, like, for example, um, with the Fleet Toe, they went back and changed, added a couple of liveries in here and there. And I, and it, it's not vehicles that I'm referring, I'm going to refer, or I'm going to talk about in this video. It's more like a few things I want them to, like, add or bring back into the, into the game to make it fun, you know, more fun than, than, you know, before. But, you know, first of all, like, I want, like I said, like, I would be really freaking disappointed, um, if they don't add a, or do a map, map expansion, and at this point, there's no excuse, there's no, literally no excuse for them to be like, oh, well, um, uh, we can't, we can't, um, we can't do that. We, we don't have the, we don't have, you know, they can't handle like, um, trust me, the PS5 and the new gen, gen can, um, hold up, you know, hold, you know, the, the, this map and the new map and probably, you know, liver city or something like that. I want to see a new map expansion and um new attachments for the weapons you know because um i've been playing a lot of lately i've been playing a lot of call of duty and i talked to myself well, how come we don't have this deep in deep customization that cold war has you know cold war you can put a rifle scope in one of these a pistol scope on one of these so rockstar you know and you can you know you can actually put a pistol scope on one of these. So, I would like to see more attachments to be added. You know, like the Mark II, Mark II weapons that we have. You know, like, add on to that. Like, Rockstar, you're you're up to, you're, you're on to something. Just add to the Mark II weapons and, you know, add more attachments. If you have to, make these. I want to see this, this rocket launcher because I'm... In the fight, it's the size of the fight. You know what, fuck that, it's the size of the gun. I want to I want to see a a Mark II weapon on a Mark II grenade launcher like one of these big ones not a little tiny pistol grenade launcher cuz I am really I mastered this freaking grenade launcher down to the to the thing and you're going to be like oh, well John uh that's really that's really cool it's you know but you realize that you know uh, um the grenade launcher does not compare to a weapon or a sniper rifle or um you know uh, uh like, I have more respect for someone that can, you know, kill me with one of these than one of these. Because this, oh, this one is just fucking easy. I've seen, I seen, you know, the last, last couple of weeks, I've been playing Cold War and Black Ops 4. And I've seen a lot of people killing, you know, kill me with the, this. Like, this is... Come on, this is so fucking easy to get killed with. This, in compare, you have to time it, you have to measure the height. There's a lot of, you know, elements to go into killing somebody with one of these. And like I said, you know, let's let's come back to the, you know, the the thing in question. I want to see like a lot of more added weapons. Like I want to, I want to see them back. Uh, bring back the old school um, variant. You know, well, this is one of the variants, but, you know, I want to see that, like, that Grand Theft Auto Vice City variant. This is kind of, I don't, yeah, I, I want to see, like, you know, that, I know it's the same shotgun and everything, but I want to see, like, you know, the one in Vice City had that stock folded up. You know, I want to see that variant return. Either you can either bring back that variant, Rockstar, or you could just make this a Mark II weapon and make you know add more customization like i said um 
And, you know, there's a lot of more things you can do, like, freaking, like I say, I want to see another, I don't, I want to see the bazooka return, like the bazooka, the flamethrower, um, there's a lot of other weapons that they haven't added into the, into Grand Theft Auto that I want to see them return, and I don't know, like, I just, like I said, like, I just feel like Rockstar... Lately has been resting on their morals and or not morals but asses because now there's just like okay we're just gonna like add this this and this to keep them happy so they can keep buying shark cards and you know as you guys can see I have this ton this much money in my bank account and tr I've been I got the money not by sh buying shark cards I've been grinding this game you know day in and day out. I've been, you know, over the last seven, eight years, I've been, you know, working my ass off to to get all these properties in the map. And I would like to see, like, you know, a new car, a new variant, variants of weapons. Um, I don't know, like something, something new, like, you know, like, for example, I want to, I want to see, like, you know, the SAC models return from, you know, from you know uh, Vice City, some cars return from Vice City, some from you know San Andreas, and yeah, like I would like to see the the freaking cor Corvette, Coquette or Corvette from Vice City return. You know, there's a lot of things that potential that GTA 5 the enhanced version can bring to the table, but like I said before. They promised a good fucking game with Red Dead Online. They're like, oh, um, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, like, fucking make you, we're gonna, you know, we're make you happy, we're gonna make Red Dead, you know, we're gonna all add all this shit in, and, 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 and like, fucking Rockstar. Just, like, don't be like, you know, the fucking, you, you're start, starting to sound like a fucking president. You're... Saying things, promising things, but when it comes to it, you just like fall down on your ass, and and it's about time to you know for put a little more flavor into you know your fucking games, cause you know it's just like don't get me wrong, Rockstar is good, and I I love their past games, and specifically Vice City, and not and Vice City stories is okay, but mainly Vice City. But like I said before in one of my past videos, that you know they were eventually gonna screw up, you know, Red Dead Online, and they do. What what what, the, what this last update do? Like a new role, a new role. That's just I don't know. I feel like you know they can add more to Red Dead. They can bring bring it back to life. They can add ranches. Like they can add a whole bunch of shit. And I hope. I hope that they don't do with GTA what they did with with um with um Red Dead Online promise after promise after promise and just don't you know they don't freaking do it like I can see them they can easily add mansions for example um if they do add if they ever add on um the Vice City map they can e easily, but I know they won't because they're, um, they're just afraid. Let's just put it that way, you know? They're afraid. They can easily, if we could ever get the map, the Vicity map, or expansion, or whatever you want to fucking call it, we can, they can easily give us the mansion from the original, original Vice City. Like, you know what I'm gonna, uh, for those of you who played Vice City, you know what I'm talking about. You know that mansion that had a helipad and a fucking dock, a boat dock in the back, and that pool, a giant pool, and a freaking maze and shit. That was one of my favorite properties in that game. And trust me, I know, I remember it. I was like seven years old, six years old, seven years old when you know that you know that came out. And freaking, how can I not remember it? It just like stuck with me, and till this day, like I'm. Like, I'm hearing rumors that they might remaster, you know, Vice City and San Andreas and GTA 3. And I hope that they, those rumors are true. 
But I hope they don't do it with like intentions of cashing in. You know, like oh wait, we're, a lot of people, a lot of um game companies are um mm, remastering um old games. Hey, mm, um we're gonna do the same, so we can um what's that word called? What's that word? Oh yeah, cash in. Like I hope they if they do those rumors are true. I hope they do it with love, not with like a fucking gold digger fool. I just, I just hope, you know, they can easily, like I said, they can easily add, they can make both games, GTA and, and, and Red Dead Online better, but in this case, we're on this video, we're going to be focusing more on Red, um, uh, GTA, the enhanced version, or the remastered version, whatever you want to fucking call it, you know, um, and, you know, they can easily add, uh, um, Livery City, um, Vice City and some Fierro, literally, and not make it where Cayo Perico, where we have to do a fucking, you know, a fucking mission or just travel here to go to Cayo Perico. Nah, 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 bro. You can, you can make it a full legit map, and instead of freaking, instead of freaking like going to Cayo Perico and staying there, and then once you like freaking stay there and you turn off your console, um. You you're, you're spawn back in Los Santos. No, they can do a, a giant map like this. And here here's my idea. Here's my idea, Rockstar. Freaking, you can easily do a whole giant map like this from Vice City to uh, Liberty City to San Fierro to Las Venturas. Well, you don't really need to do a, a separate map for Las Venturas. You could just expand this and put it like Las Venturas and Los Santos can actually be, you know, in the same section, and then, you know, you could just, like, put it in, but with, for Liberty City and Vice City, you can, you know, let's say, you know, book a ticket, you know, a plane ticket to go to Las Ventura, I mean, to Liberty City or Vice City, and then, let's say, you, you don't come back to Los Santos, right, you don't come back, what you can, what you can do, Rockstar, you can, they can... If you turn off, let's say, I log out, or, you know, people, you know, in general, they just pretend, you know, we're playing uh, on the GTA map, or, I mean, on Vice City map, or, or Liberty City map, and let's say, I'm, I'm needing to go somewhere in real life, and I turn off my console, and instead of them, when I return and turn back my console up and log, log back on to online, instead of spawning back in Los Santos, it would be a lot more sense... If you just spot me in Liver City or Vice City, you know, stuff like that. You don't need to, like, freaking make, you know, such a big deal. Changes like that, like, add new attachments. Because, and new weapons, too, like, new new weapons, new attachments, new clothing, like, new, like, old retro clothing items, you know. And, like, new car, old car models, you can, like, put them up to date, like I said. Um... You know, there's a few car models that you you could you know bring back. You know, like I said, like the one the Corvette and the Viper from Vice City and and San Andreas. You know, there's a few couple of things in there. But just let me know down in the comments if you guys think if this is such a good idea to like you know add that, make them you know add new attachments for the next version to, for weapons and you know and stuff like that. New properties and you know just let me know in the comments if you would like this way for rockstar to do this if not then you know you know that's okay if you you don't know you know understand my idea but like i said you know this is would make gta spicy again you know we can actually them adding new weapons we can go back to 2013 when people are killing each other with weapons and not flying brooms Cause nowadays you're going pew pew, and they're like, "Oh fuck, fool! You just kill me! I'm gonna get my flying broom and kill your ass and sweep the the the, the floor with you!" Pew pew pew, you know. But hey, that could that in in real in theory that can actually work. You know, they can make it better. But let me know in the comments, put down below, and remember, stay away from the haters. Subscribe if you bring news to the channel. And leave a like if you like my sarcasm. 
and peace out.